wabarakatuh. Hello everyone, I am Elena Gita Lestari and I'm from Manuan Pasuruan. I would like to tell you a story about Bawang Putih and Bawang Merah. Please enjoy the story. A long time ago, there lived a couple husband and wife. They have a very beautiful daughter. Her name is Bawang Putih. They also have a neighbor. She is a widow. Her name is Mbak Randa. And she has a daughter. Her name is Bawang Mera. Bawang Putih's father was a seller and he likes a long trip. When Bawang Putih's father went to the city, Mbak Randa and Bawang Mera start there every day. When Bawang Putih's mother was alone at the house, suddenly Mbak Randa and Bawang Mera came and offered her some food. She said, Bawang Putih's mother, I made it for you. Please try it. Mbak Randa gave a poison to the food her made because she was jealous to her. Okay, uh, thank you very much Mbak Randa and Bawang Mera. I will try it. After Bawang Putih's mother is that food, she, uh, she fell on the floor. Uh, help me. Her voice trembled and so tormented. A few minutes later, Bawang Putih came back from the river and she was shocked, saw her mother faint. Ah, oh, mother, are you okay? Mother, what happened? Bawang oh, I'm sorry. I love you. She brought her last. And she passed away. Bawang Putih was crying. No, mother, no, please don't let me. Please, somebody please help me. But nobody helped her. Tomorrow morning, Bawang Putih's father come back. Hello, everyone, I'm home. Bawang Putih saw her father and she ran. Father, she started crying. something. So what do you want guys from the city? Maranda said, Darling, can you buy me a mini jewelries? And Bangara said, um, I want a mini beautiful dress, father, and shoes too. And Bangara said, um, I just want a white rose maybe and your set, father. Okay, I will get what you ask. Bye bye all. After their father left them, Bawang Rondo and Bawang Mera began rude to Bawang Putih. So Putih, what are you doing now? You must wash all clothes, plates, and do all kind of housework. Yes, wash my clothes until like new. Yes, mother, sister. No, quickly. Every single day, Bawang Putih always abused by Bawang Rondo and Bawang Mera. But one day, she went to the river, and suddenly, she heard someone screams. Oh no! Oh, uh, help me, help me! Can you help me, Miss Finger? Who? And where are you? I'm here, I'm here! Uh, my leg injuries because stuck in that problem is... Okay, I will help you, hold on! Thank you very much, Bawang Puti. Uh, how you know my name? Uh, I forget it, Bawang. Uh, my name is Ikan Mas. <laughs> anyway, uh, do you want to be my friend? Uh, friends? Of course, we can be best friends too. Come on, following my motion. I, you, forever, together. Yay, best friend. Every day, Bawang Puti and Ikan Mas always playing together. And then, Bawang Mera saw them. And Bawang Mera her ikan mas secretly and make her never come back again to the river. Bawang Buddha was so sad because she never seen ikan mas again. But she remembered that ikan mas ever gave something to her. And then she burnt that. And a miracle happened. On the grave, thrown up a gold plate. And the news heard by the kingdom. And the kingdom sent a crowd to take the gold plane. We are from the kingdom, want to take a gold plane for the queen medicine. But I'm not smirk. Oh, so you want this? You can take it, but you must pay dearly for this. Won't you? One of them trying to take the gold plane. 
hand. Maybe you are a turret. Let me help take it. Oh. 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 It's really hard. I can't. I can't. It's really hard. Morondo and Bawamera, also the car, can take the gold thing. And then came Bawamputi. And she said, let me help take it. Bawamputi can take the gold thing easily. And she gave it to the guard. Bawamera and Bawarondo gave angry face to her. After three days later, the queen has been recovered. And the prince come to Bawamputi's house to say thank you to her. And finally, they meet each other. Bawamputi. Thank you very much. I promise I will marry the girl who has been make my mother cover. Bhagwati was shocked. And the prince said, again, So, may I take your hand, become part of my life, opportunity? Bhagwati? Bhagwati answered, Yes, of course, yes. The prince carried Bhagwati to the kingdom to meet the queen. The queen was very happy to meet Balamputi, and she agreed both of them to get married. When wedding ceremony was held, Mbarando and Balamera were very angry. Balamera for says, Oh, mother, why Balamputi marry with the prince? Why not me? I don't know. With angry face, they were too screaming. They live happily forever. The end. So, the moral message is those who do evil and are pretty will get what they deserve. And every good deed will get good results too. Thank you very much for listening to my story. See you next time. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.